I'm Scott Hill with Hill People Gear, and I'm here to introduce you to a new piece of the mobility line, which is the Expedition Kit. One of the components or types of gear that we see most lacking in most people's loadouts is first aid. Um, it's just not sexy. Hopefully it fails the did I use it last trip out test, because really we hope you're not having to use first aid kits when you're out, but it is something you, you should carry. Uh, what we see is at a minimum people are carrying tourniquets and that's a wonderful thing because tourniquets are one of the few things you can't improvise in the time allotted to get one on, but it's really just a small component. A trauma kit is a small component of a well-rounded first aid kit for backcountry travel. The reality is most of what you're going to run into in the backcountry is small cuts, abrasions, twisted ankles, stomach distress, kind of the everyday maladies that you might run into at home. But whereas at home you have stuff to deal with it or can run to the Walgreens on the corner, in the backcountry you don't. So you need to be carrying a first aid kit with you and know how to do it. So what we did was team up with North American Rescue to come out with the Expedition Kit, which is a well-rounded first aid kit designed for overlanding use, boating use, uh, maybe for a SAR guy who wants to carry a little bit more comprehensive first aid kit, crew kit, for trail crew or something like that, or just a family kit to have for when you're out doing stuff. It comes in a red Powell's pocket, and the inside is organized into modules or components using a red tool roll and then North American Rescue's insert bags. We've divided it up into trauma, wound care, splinting, and a miscellaneous kit, which has kind of your internal medicine stuff, um, tweezers, uh, shears, trying to think what else, a little guidebook and that kind of thing. And then on the front, we actually have another module, which is your burn care that slots into that pocket. And finally, in the front zipper pocket, we have the splint, because that won't fit into the splinting module inside. When you get the Expedition Kit, it won't look quite the way this looks because for FDA reasons, it can't be packed into these sub bags. So what you'll get is an overall large plastic bag that has the components themselves with a packing list inside plastic bags in there. And then it'll be up to you to go ahead and do the organization the way you want. All of these different bag modules have Velcro strips, so you actually can choose what your trauma is, what your wound care is, and that kind of thing, and then what your priority is. Personally, I've laid it out so that the trauma is something I can get to really easily here just by pulling that tool roll out. So I don't have to pull anything out of the bag, I don't have to undo any zippers. It's just simply a matter of ripping Velcro and flopping, and then I have access to all that kind of stuff in there. Now, is this a kit that includes stuff like IVs and that kind of thing? No. If you feel the need to plus it up, you certainly can. But our goal was to just provide a nice, simple, straightforward, well-rounded kit. Now, the, the last thing I want to talk about is training. As I alluded to earlier, a lot of medical issues can be taken care of with other means. It's just much easier to have a kit with you. But all the kit in the world doesn't help you out if you don't know how to use it. And the thing with back country is you're not getting a shower daily, or at least I don't, maybe the way you're doing it, you do. Um, and little things can grow to be big things. A cut that gets infected can turn septic. Maybe your minorly, minorly sprained ankle, since you don't have anything to wrap it with, now becomes a big issue and you've lost mobility. So we recommend and really suggest that you get out, get some good training, and know how to use this stuff because not only can it make your trip a little bit more pleasant because you can deal with stuff, but it might also save your life.